a few years ago, it's just, it was the old machine. It pinched, it hurt. I left crying. And when I started doing them a few years ago, I would say they were painful. It took me three years to come back. I stayed in my vehicle for about five minutes before walking into the building because I dreaded coming into using the machine. And now, using this new machine, I know what to expect. Okay, so today you're gonna be in charge of your own compression. My first impression of the Pristina machine was finally somebody thought about the woman when they made the machine. The Duettas, they give women control of their breast exam. And that's actually pretty darn important for most women. Well, it's kind of always our policy here. Every single patient you bring in the room, you tell them you're in control. If I'm using too much compression, you tell me stop. So I've kind of replaced that with, you're gonna help me today. You're gonna be the one, you're responsible for your own compression. Patient comfort is, is a huge barrier, especially women who come in for their first time mammograms. If they delayed it, it's usually because they were afraid that it was going to be painful. Well, there are two parts of, of high compression. Number one is it reduces dose to the patient. They're getting less radiation if we have less breast tissue to go through. Number two, you usually get clearer pictures. I can't find a cancer if I don't have the tissue in the mammogram. So the more comfortable a patient is, the more tissue I will get in the mammogram machine and the clearer an image I will get. I would say 90% of the patients that I ask are willing to try it and want to do it. Take it as far as you can. I think we do a good job of educating them and just kind of getting them excited about it before we get started. Press and hold this top plus sign. That's going to lower down the It compression. was different having a remote control. Having women uh, have control of their own exams does help in the clinical experience. Adding the Duetta, every woman likes to be in control and uh, make those decisions. I like the idea of channel surfing on it, very much like operating my remote from my sofa at home. I just pushed the remote and it made me feel good. All right, now you compress. I was able to compress to where I needed to be and it took the pictures the doctor needed. It was nice because I knew what to expect. I mean, I knew how tight it was gonna get instead of waiting to see how tight it was gonna get. And at least now women have more control of the testing, whereas in the past you never had that control. What we're hearing is, I can't believe that the patient is giving us more compression than we were able to get last year. I was interested in the fact that she said that typically you can handle more of the compression if you're doing it yourself. And I found that to be true, absolutely. I think I was a typical tech, type A personality, I don't, I don't want the patient to compress themselves. Like, how are we gonna control that? Um, after using it, I love it. And patients that I have used it on typically are going way above and beyond the compression we've done on previous years. She actually said that I compressed farther than they did last year to myself. I did it farther than, I think she said I went to a 12 and I only did a seven last year. It does make sense that, that we would give women the control to have a machine that allows the patients to feel that they are in control, yet still get more compression. That's just the perfect marriage that we like to see. And it seems to be really positive. People are saying that they're gonna tell their friends. If one will get more patients to, to come and get a screening mammogram, then I will always choose the one that will get more patients in the door because then it's more cancers that I can find early. We want people that are gonna return every year and we can keep taking care of them, spot things early. It restored my faith and I will come back.